I'm Deanna Russo, and you're watching No Good Motherfucking Television. Whoa. <laughs> She's Whoa. wasted! I'm so drunk right now. <laughs> and that's why people are gonna like to watch Knight Rider. That's the only reason why people like me anyway is when I'm drunk. It's kind of sad. Me too, I get that all the time. But people are funnier when I'm drunk. Don't you find? Yes. Other people are way funnier when I'm wasted. I think you're hilarious. <laughs> wow. <laughs> TV bar. Why? Because Knight Rider's coming back! Dude, it's a talking car. It is. It's the coolest thing ever. I told him he couldn't fit in here, but he's like, I'll transform. And I'm like, don't change for me. I love you for the way you are. Aww. Yeah. Does Kit know he's not a transformer, really? He just wants to be real bad. Here, here, he can hear you. Don't <laughs> say something. So I'm sorry, Kit. I apologize. I'm sorry. <laughs> So you have driven the car. Many times. And have you tried to pick up some boys in the car? I'm not very good at it. Yeah, but you have the car. You I don't know. even have to say anything. But see, like, it's like, you know, I try to whistle or like say, hey, baby, and they're just like, <laughs> you know, and the guys just keep walking because they just like don't want anything to do with it. He's like my <laughs> older brother. It's yeah. like riding around with my older brother all the time. <laughs> Oh need, my god, that's I need sucks. to work on my game. I really do. How do we convince Kit that it's okay for you to date? I suggest you take off your clothes. Okay. Maybe you could take him out sometime right. and get him drunk and so like put the maybe. wrong flavor oil in him. Yeah. See what happens. It could be a pleasant accident or just happy it out, you know what I'm be. saying? And then I'll go out and he won't know and well, you know him better than me, so how do I get his batteries charged? Oh, what is Kit like? <laughs> What's that kind of guy into? He's like a little kid in the sense that he's very innocent. He likes to learn about things, mm. especially things that have to do with human nature, because he just doesn't get it. D does he know about the female body? He Yes, but in a scientific way. Mm. So maybe you could teach Roll around him naked in the back seat? There you go. OK, Done. good. We'll learn by osmosis. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I wonder what kind of shifters. <laughs> oh goodness. When you and Michael Knight smoke weed in the car, yes. does Kit start getting loopy? He starts coughing a lot <laughs> and drives really slow. <laughs> and the next thing I know, we're at Jack in the Box. All we want to do is have a good time, eat, drink, smoke, fuck, and that would be fire. Tell me about Michael Knight. Yummy.com and a half. What was that for? Because I thought I was going to die. But you were babe of the month. Guess who else was babe of the month? I heard. Awesome. You had, um, um, how do you explain it? Was like a big necklace on. That yeah. Was the end. yeah. That was all. <laughs> and really, the necklace just got in the way. <laughs> Tell me about all the fucked up things that you guys get to do while you're just waiting for things to be shot. Um, I do something a little risky. I crochet. Whoa! I crochet like a machine. I've made like 20 blankets this year. Blankets. Like, like full size, full king blankets. size duvet. I don't stop. I'm, 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 I'm hooked. I'm hooked on the hooking. The, oh the my god, hook. she's a hooker. I'm a hooker. <laughs> I told you it was a little risky. Can you make like cock socks and stuff? Um, yes, that's actually my specialty. Because I think that there's a few people here, you know, it gets cold, it's winter. Right yeah, now. you know, sometimes you need a little... You might want to sell those. That's a... You know what? You could make a Done. ton of money. Don. Right? It's totally doing that. <laughs> so I can make little like, you know, socks that don't close. So it's like a... That would actually be good because leg warmers they call those usually. Yeah, leg warmers. <laughs> yeah, little little penis warmers. You know. Oh. Right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just keep the head free. Cheers. Okay. <laughs> this right here is why everyone now will be watching Knight Rider because religiously. <laughs> I love the balls. <laughs> they just have their own kind of little. Don't they always? <laughs> They always have a mind of their own. They can they can sit up. These these pillows can sit up and do things. They can speak if you want them to. 
What, what do they say to you? Mine's a little lazy right now, oh. but you get the idea anyway. He he whispers things into my ear. <laughs> They're sweet, wet nothings. <laughs> Go ahead, see what yours says. <laughs> That's awesome. Mine's... Oh great, mine just said he likes brunettes. That's awesome. Oh. Thanks so much for that. <laughs> yeah, now you get to. Hi, Dad. <laughs> Motherfucking shit. Watch Night Rider. Wednesday nights at 8, NBC. Thank you. <laughs>I literally had a, literally had a holy shit moment. Like, Do you guys talk about poop? Real? We I can mean, totally talk about poop if you want to talk about scat and the whole thing. Yes, go I, ahead. I went to China. I was spoiled because I was working there and I was spoiled where like a lot of Americans go. So they had normal toilets. So I assumed everywhere in China had normal toilets. I also like couldn't go at all. Like I was just couldn't go. Like yeah. for like a whole week, kind of ridiculous, like bad shape. Something started rumbling and I was like, Yes, I gotta go, sorry. Like, and I'm like, like shimmying, shimmying, and everybody's like this tall, and I'm just like, out of the way, out of the way. <laughs> and I see a sign for a bathroom. So there's no way I could have made it all the way back up to my room. Well, I walk into the bathroom, and there's two stalls, but inside the stall was just this hole in the ground. It was like ceramic, oh. but it was just a hole. And I'm like, duh, no time. So I just let it go, and it was awesome. It was literally a holy <laughs> shit, because it was just like everywhere and glorious, and it made me so happy, uh -huh. because you know, I mean, and I was up close and personal, like getting this awesome vantage point, you know, because you gotta squat. And yes. I mean, it was just everywhere and awesome. And then I realized, <laughs> the Chinese don't believe in toilet paper, or they just don't have it. And I was like, what do I do now? And I'm like looking in like the waste paper basket, trying to find like anything not so used. And I'm like, wait a minute, on my way here, I grabbed a moist towelette from the <gasps> airport. Good girl. I looked into my purse and there was this like, shiny happy face of like Catherine Zeta-Jones, like promoting T-Mobile or something. I was like, I love you, Catherine. <laughs> so I ripped it up and it saved my life. <laughs> Yeah. Does so, Catherine know that she saved your life? Have you well, put that story out there? <laughs> that was my big moment coming here. I was hoping, really hoping she could see this. Oh, segment. that is beautiful. Yes. That, that was my holy shit moment. That was the serious holy shit moment. That may have been my favorite holy shit moment really? ever. Yes. I'm honored. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're so I went there. I wasn't sure if I should go there, but I went there. <laughs> Always go there. Totally paid off. Don't <laughs> ever hold back. Ever, <laughs> ever. Not here at No Good TV. <laughs> Who's your daddy? It's no good!